What's up guys? Today I'm doing a model tier list. So we're gonna start with phase one. I'm doing gonna do it in parts, five parts. I'm doing phase one. Okay. Before I start here, I've seen Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 just now. And yeah. But we're gonna start phase one, which is Spider-Man to the Amazing Spider-Man. Phase two, Iron Man three to Ant-Man. Phase three, Captain America Civil War, Spider-Man Far From Home. And phase four, WandaVision to the Guardians of the Galaxy Holiday Special. Phase five, Ant Man the Wild Quantum Media to the Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. So here we are, starting with Spider-Man. This is a very great film. I love this film. Like, the origin story to Spider-Man is great. I have to put it in, like... Yeah, it is great. So we got Spider-Man 2. Spider-Man 2 is better than Spider-Man 1, but still great. I believe in, like, top 10 MCU movies to the legendary. I think it's better because, like, Doc Ock has more action and stuff. Spider-Man 3, though... It's bottom tier. I, I don't really like Spider Man 3. So, yeah. Iron Man. This is the one that started the actual MCU. This is a very enjoyable, enjoyable film. It does have its flaws. So that's why I can't give it the great category. I'll think about it later. But for now, it's going into it. The Incredible Hulk is bottom. I don't know if anybody could explain that one. Armin 2. Yeah, this one, Edward Norton, doesn't fit. Armin 2 is enjoyable but flawed. Like, I like it, but it is very flawed. It's not my favorite, but yeah. Thor is same. It's enjoyable but flawed. Like it has its good moments, but also it's bad. Camera, the first Avenger. Is... I want to say bottom, but I want to say enjoyable but flawed. But I don't think it's terrible. I just don't think it's great. I want to say it's enjoyable but flawed. Tricky. I'm gonna give it the top actually. I'm enjoyable with flawed. Okay. The Avengers. This one. Mm. It's hard to decide. This is a good movie, but. I gotta give it right there. Like I said, I might switch this around later. And the last one is The Amazing Spider-Man. Amazing Spider-Man is enjoyable but flawed. Very easily. And that's going to include our Phase 1. Until next time, guys. Bye-bye.